Welcome to Joy. It's a new JavaScript framework for building reactive and real-time updating user interfaces. We have two different tabs here, but any data is bound two ways. So I can update this to something like real-time, and it updates instantaneously. All right, what does the code look like? Let's jump over. It's a super small file, only 59 lines of HTML and CSS. The main thing here is I have a, a Joy style sheet dropped in to make creating beautiful um, interfaces easy from the design, st design standpoint, but you can use whatever CSS that you want. The more important piece is you drop in the script tag, which has Joy in it. And that's about it. That's all you need to do. Everything else is just HTML templating for your app. So let's scroll down. The most important piece that you need to be looking at here is the name attribute on the app. The name attribute tells Joy the namespace that the data lives inside of. So everything inside of this div is going to be under, underneath that uh, data namespace. So we don't have any templating here. We're going to go straight to what you saw as updating, which was this um, this third item in the app, uh, this one down here. This third item has a template of C inside of it. And that template is going to get updated in real time with the data that's bound to the C property. But it's not just the C property. It's bound under best, which was the name of the app. Then inside of that, there is the name three, which is the third item in this display, the best of what, the third best thing that we have today. So best dot three, and then we're changing the image source with the C value. So best dot three dot C. Okay. Um, so that's also true with this tag here, which is the content. Um, and that's bound to the name property of what? So rather than the image being bound to .c, the text that shows up in front is bound to .what, and that is content editable. So anything that we then change as we type on the content editable of that div element gets bound to name.what, which then updates in real time to the other um, pages, to the other browser uh, tabs and different devices. It updates in real time syncing. So let's give an example of that with the image source, okay? Which should be bound to best.3.c. I'm gonna jump over here, um, grab this image source. I'm gonna come over to the app, and I'm just gonna sneakily change it for um, the first item, the uh, best.1.c. Um, I'm gonna just do it quickly over here. Um, but realistically, you'd be creating an interface for editing the data there. And there, it, it updated. So if I come up and I refresh, you'll see that the data persists. So not only are your applications reactive, progressive, and persistent, things update in real time. Well, I hope that gives you a quick uh, preview of what Joy looks like. And you jump into the docs and try it out yourself.